lecture i'm going to discuss what how to add column with default value to an existing table in microsoft sql server so here i'm using the table score.emp is the tables there this place i want to add the new column with some value so we have a query like this alter table give the table name then this place you need to give your column name constant going to create with the name of fk underscore dpt number this is the constant name after that after that this is the default values that's giving so column that created with the name of test one the value is now 10 now let's so uh, test this query so command completed successfully now thereafter let's here you can see the new column that created with the here or default value or 10 after that uh, this place you can add here int value or this place you can add here back here. so the same thing alter table and giving the score.emp altering adding the new column test2 this is here varchar tab it was here it was integer this tabs varchar and constant or uh, new constant that's giving here fk underscore dpt number so default value that's uh, here hr so new column that's created with the value hr now let's uh, run this query then here command successfully after that uh, let's uh, run this so here you can see new column that's created with the name of test2 and here value is now hr after that i'm trying to delete this so uh, these tools are not uh, essential if you want to delete then if i run this add alter table score drop test1 and test2 so it's not working because here the table has some constraint is there so first uh, we need to remove the constraint so remove constant fk underscore this one remove and next constant is now fk underscore dpt number okay so now uh, dpt number now uh, here let's uh, run so uh, now you can see the here table alter now this time is going to remove so remove test one and test two okay here we need to check that test one and test two so let's give here test two and now altering so this terms command successfully and here you can see or uh, this here that's deleted now to add the columns you need to add write this query add order table and add test one this is the integer here you can give any meaningful value this place let's give your 20 so this times the new column created with the value default value 20 20 that's good so this is how we can add the column with default value to an existing table in microsoft sql server so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next to it thank you